Hello everyone, today we'll be using the app Display Recorder to capture today's video session and we'll also be testing out the new Sensu Solo Brush Stylus. I'll have a full review for that in a future video. Originally this video length was 29 minutes and it was a whopping 88 megs in size. I actually used the uh, Motion Pix app to do the time lapse to increase it to uh, seven times the normal speed. And that helped bring the overall length of, down from 29 minutes to just over three minutes. Today's project features fellow paper artist Claudio. Now, Claudio is one of my favorite paper artists. Uh, he hails from the country of Italy. And I'll link the page to his Tumblr in the description below. Now I must note that the Display Recorder app is a jailbreak app. It is not found in the Apple App Store. Now after using a Display Recorder for a little bit, I must say I really like this uh, setup. Uh, I was using Reflector previously to mirror the iPad onto my PC and then take that video file and then use I was using Windows Live Movie Maker to do the time lapse to bring it down or speed it up actually and once the video was edited bring it back into the iPad and use iMovie to edit and add the text and all that good stuff now with Display Recorder I can do everything on the iPad which I really like I dislike connecting the iPad or having the iPad in any way, shape or form, be dependent on the PC for anything. So I really like this setup. Another advantage Display Recorder has over using Reflector, Reflector had some trouble keeping up with the speed I use when I'm doing the blending using the brush tool. And Display Recorder has no problems keeping up with uh, the speed that I use when I'm blending areas with a brush tool either with a stylus or with my fingers. Now the only negatives using Display Recorder occasionally bringing up the toolbar tray uh, all I would see was the color mixer but just tapping any of the areas where the tools were would bring them up and the tap size where it shows my finger or stylus on touching the screen was a little bit larger than the ones offered from Reflector. I'll definitely be using this process in the future making of videos. It still remains to be seen if I can do an entire piece from start to finish. If I can stitch them uh, within a certain time length, I'll try to do that. Thanks for watching everyone. I'll leave you now with the final finished piece.